Welcome along then to what promises to be another fascinating Spanish Grand Prix. A race which saw Max Verstappen win on his first ever appearance with the Red Bull team in 2016. This after the dramatic coming together of Lewis Hamilton and Nico Rosberg on the first lap. Will we see more moments for the scrapbook here today? The Circuit de Barcelona Catalunya, a track that will certainly force the drivers to push themselves. It consists of a very impressive main straight going into turn one. It's a straight that also offers a DRS zone, so it's likely to be a hot spot for overtakes. And as with the race minutes away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. An immense lap from Lewis Hamilton yesterday puts him on pole position, and Valtteri Bottas will line up alongside. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Verstappen, Vettel, Charles Leclerc, Iceman, Albon, Perez, Ricardo, and Lance Stroll, Norris, Gasly, Esteban Ocon, and Magnussen, Grosjean, Kvyat, Kimi Raikkonen, and George Russell, Giovinazzi, and Nicholas Latifi. Now, it's almost time. After the points finish last race, let's aim to keep the momentum going. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back for yet another episode of F1 2020 Career Mode. Now, today we're in the Spanish Grand Prix. We've run through this Grand Prix actually in F2. We actually didn't do too bad. Uh, there's a few little tricky spots where we can really get the tails to stick to kick out, really. But we should be fine with these F1 cars. They have much more done for us. At least that's what it feels like. So we're doing a soft, medium, medium strategy. We're 7, 13, 13. But without further ado, I think we should probably jump in and try to get a good start not break our front wing uh jeff really kind of dived into us this email message saying oh hey you should probably watch out for uh like you should probably try to keep your front wing on your car i'm like yeah i totally agree with you but turn once uh can be madness here i don't know who that is behind me oh it's alex album kit Yeah, we didn't qualify too bad. I'm quite happy with our qualifying position. I thought I'd go a little bit faster, but Lewis and Valtteri really pulled out all the stops in the end. Really We've late turn there. That's not great, but it's not terrible. Stay focused. It's instinctively press the DRS button. That's the corner I gotta watch out for. That really, you can really get your car to stand, kick out the, kick out the backhand. You can lose a lot of time. Not doing too bad so far. We want to close that gap a little bit more and increase our gap from Ricardo in the back. Carry a bit more speed in there as well. second of the car ahead and in the DRS Ooh, zone. We're just a bit too far away. Mm 
That uh, corner kind of wrong. We've got a lot of spare energy. Use your overtake button. Okay, going in for the pits. Come on. Complete, go now. The car goes right behind us. Up to speed now. Let's get some heat into those tires. Oh, somebody broke front wing. That was a nice pass to there. What was that? Engine troubles we're having here? Oh, our uh, MG unit. MGU unit. No idea what that is. Take and burn some of this energy.
Oh, the player is out. I must have hit him. I wonder if that was the fault there or not. We need to go back and look at the replay. Yeah, to teammate ahead is 18.0 seconds. your MFD for a new strategy option. Confirm. We're going in. Confirm. Confirmed. Going in for a new wing. I guess I really didn't listen to uh, Jeff. Uh, broke our front wing on the last on that last corner there. Well, still, well, not last corner, the last long stretch corner. So, release, release. Are we? Do we keep our original tires? No, well, I guess we're going back in mediums. Okay. We'll be doing one more stop today. One stop left in our strategy. Hi. Lando is in the pits. Lando in the pits. Okay, clear. Madison, why are you defending so much? God damn. Knowing level of defending, come on.
Killing our teammate by 19.6 seconds. Check your MFD for a new strategy option. Confirm. Got that confirmed. Okay, we're going in for our last, or we're, well, we're, just, we're going in for soft for 10 laps. Uh, see what we can do here. Not even 10, 6, 7, 8 laps, 7 laps. Exit, exit now. Maybe we can get a chance to get some kind of points, because right now we're not doing well. That front wing just killed us. Okay, At the same time, our MGUK is not good. Our ERS deployment is much lower than it was. So we're not going to be... we're not in a good, a good place right now. Even though we set a 119... a 118 I think time in qualifying. you can use overtake to get past. The gap to the car behind is 10.0 seconds. Not close enough for the overtake. Give a fun stroll, a little love tap there. Because someone was like, "Hey, man, I'm from Canada. Let's go." Okay, you're catching the car ahead, but remember, we need to get to the end of the race on these tires. I got you, Jeff. We have five laps of fuel remaining. That happened again. So been looking at the damage, and we think you should be okay to continue. It'll cost us a little bit of time, but we're nearly at the end of the race. A new strategy is available on the MFD. Okay, copy that. Too much damage that problem wing actually did to us. Okay, where are we 
reaching a danger point with the wear on the MGUH. Overheating the engine will exacerbate the issue, so keep the temps under control. Can we carry down the chip yet? to the car in front is 5.3 seconds. There's three laps of fuel remaining. Excess fuel. We'll be back on target soon. Don't wait too long to turn the engine down. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. than a lap of fuel now. The tank is empty.
Oh man, that was just a rough race. That's yes. the end of the race. We'll see you in Park Fermi. Twelfth place, started six, ended up twelfth. Damaged our front wing twice, and our teammate is down the bit. You pretty much swapped places with our teammate. That's always good. Give our teammate a bit of a boost, right? Man, what a race. Jeez. Kind of a bit of an uneventful race. So after a magnificent race, just a couple of mistakes. The making their way to the podium. But once again, typical. it's the Silver Arrows who... Mercedes and Red Bull up front. Let's have a look then at the driver's standings. Oh, Lando. Our championship leader is still sat at the top of the standings, but their rivals have made up some solid ground today. So, Anthony Davidson, who would you rank as your Six. driver of the day? It's got to be Lando Norris, hasn't it? Smooth, confident, yep. and assured. I've got no doubt that he and his team are going to be over the moon One with his performance three stops. today. Jeez. It's time to check out the constructors' standings. Uh, Mercedes uh. continue to extend their lead. Meanwhile, Ferrari so, have improved their position. A strong weekend from them the as fourth. they fight their bad. way towards the top. After an event like that, who knows what the sport has in store up. for us next time. Uh, Be sure to join us again the same. as we okay. continue to bring you the latest excitement in Formula 1. Yeah, not the greatest of a race, 120.3. We had a pretty fast lap time. We were up with the top players. But just that wing damage, that's the worst thing. Because we would have been right behind Max Verstappen if that could have been. That would have been right behind us. Uh, 120. Uh, Charles Leclerc was pretty quick, but... We kind of messed him up a little bit, unfortunately. Esteban Ocon didn't finish. Williams, Latifi. All right, let's see what the interview people have to say. I feel like our car was down on power a little bit as well, but that's because of their MG HUK. So, let's have your thoughts. Great work. Not at all. What are you talking about? Your teammate beat you today. Was it a setup issue or something else? Uh, not much harder than me. Car can, can't, and the car didn't buckle under pressure. So our aero department. Uh. Yeah, he drove much harder. It was more like dodgems than Formula One today, wasn't it? Yes, those were just friendly nudges. <laughs> You're right. It was like a fairground with all those clouds. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far, but you need to take things out of things a bit easier in the future. Uh, yeah, a few little nudges here and there. My bad. Appreciate your time. Okay, rivalry. Press four zero. Esteban knock on. Okay, buddy. I think our rivalry is almost done here. I think we have two or three races with him. Uh, not too many left. I don't think. I think our contracts renewal date is I think is in a couple couple months too. I believe. Let's double check. So we have turbo durability. Uh, oh man, Monaco's next. That's gonna be terrible. Personnel upgrade, weird, okay. Um, yeah, so what's what fail does is ooh, that's yeah, that's it. Motor generation unit. Uh unfortunately yeah, that's gonna be replaced. Turbocharger charger is already new, that's good. So that's gotta get fitted. Um uh, contracts, yeah, we have fifty six days until renewal. Well, not too bad, 1.58 mil. And uh, that's our standing so far. Season results. Yeah, that's our lowest finish to date so far. Lando's been pretty consistent, so. Well, with that awful of a race, that uneventful of a race, I think I'm going to end the episode here. And uh, if you like the video, hit the like button. And subscribe to keep an eye on when these episodes are coming out. And we'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.